Hi everyone, this is Kimberly from Crazy Coupon Critter and we are going to be doing a Dollar Tree haul for you. These were probably picked up in the last week or so, so hopefully you guys will be able to find them in your Dollar Tree. We've been watching a lot of YouTubers and they've been posting a lot of items and fortunately we've been able to snag quite a few of them. So on that note, let's get started. The first item I picked up were for my nephews. So uh, we found these really cute little stockings to fill. So this one's a reindeer and I think the other one was a puppy dog, I believe. So into this, most of these items came from the Dollar Tree. So uh, we found little monster trucks and they are in the box with the little wheels and stuff. We found um, like sippy cups and they're actually pretty good. I can get the lid open. There you go. So, and it's got a sippy cup there. So, and they are very uh, screw tight, so they're very waterproof. So, on that one, uh, we found what they call Seek and Find. Now, there's four books like this, and I've got two of them here. One's got reindeers, and the other one is a toy store with Santa Claus. And what they find is like little reindeers, um, penguins, hats, that kind of thing in it. We also found called Paint with Water Books. So these are coloring books that you can use for water. And so we picked those up for the boys. They also had robots. And they right here is where you press, to press it and they light up. I'm not going to do that because they're younger and we don't want to pull the plug on them yet. So these are some of the items that we found. Um, we found them scissors, so they're childproof scissors with the lock, so that comes in handy. We also found toothbrushes uh, for the younger boys is what they are. These are Hot Wheels. These are Thomas the Tank Engine. They come in a two pack. <coughs> Excuse me. So the other thing we found, which is kind of like the boring stuff, I guess you can say. We had batteries, that kind of boring stuff. Uh, the other thing, excuse me. The other thing I found were the Fruit Loops. You might have seen these. Uh, here's a tip. Kellogg's Rewards are family rewards. If you take the receipt and photocopy it to their website, they'll give you 100 points. I believe at 400 points you can get a free $5 car, uh, gift card or you can get codes for Shutterfly for free items for the pictures, uh, putting things on pictures and stuff like ornaments and stockings and items. So here's a freebie to give to you for that. It only cost you a dollar. So that works. Here I picked up a steel ruler from Jot and it comes in a pretty cool plastic sleeve and that's all shiny and pretty and boring probably but a necessity in my house. And uh, The other thing I picked up was a piece of wood of course but it says good things are coming and it's kind of cute but it's a piece of wood and I might do a do-it-yourself project maybe on it or I might keep it as is. I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. The other thing I found and if you have a Minecrafter in your family, which we do have, is we found some new Minecraft books and this one is a hardback. It's called Hacks for Minecrafters and it's very simple instructions. has some pretty cool um, pictures in them with descriptions on it and then we found uh, three paperback Minecraft books so this one is confronting the dragon and it's got a purple dragon on it with a little guy that's sword fighting it I was informed his name is Steve so I don't keep track of this stuff but I noticed here that this one has a price of six dollars this was found at the Dollar Tree. I would not be paying $6 for this book. Nope, not worth it. 
Anyways, moving on. The next book that I, we found was called The Skeleton Strike Back. Here it is. This one. Hopefully, I'm sorry. It's kind of got a glare in it. There you go. And it's got a man. And I don't know. This dude again. So, Steve, I guess. I'm being corrected back and forth. So, then the other one is the Enderman Invasion. So, this one. See, this one's six six dollars too. But this one has less pages than that other one. I think that other book I just threw down there had yeah, it had 160 pages and this one only has 103. Why would you want to pay six dollars for this book? I want it. Not me. Nope, not me. Moving on. Sorry, got kind of stuck on that one. The next one is is these comic books. Now these comic books is something we found. They come in four of them. There's Toy Story, Mickey Mouse, Frozen, and the other one is Disney Princesses. And they are very cool. Cause here's the inside of the princess one. Look at how colorful that is. So cool. And each one of them is very nice and they have short stories and it's pretty cool. Uh, the next thing I had found was these cool candles. These are cookie and cream. This is actually the uh, smells better. The other one was a caramel. It stunk. But they're by Galettos and cookies and cream is what we found. The next item we found were actual like, cookie tins. And I found these. I think these are so cool. And they're, they are tan. But look on the side of them. They're gingerbread houses and little gingerbread mans. And these are little winter figurines. Like a polar bear, snowman. I guess it's snowman and penguin. Sorry. But Santa Claus is on top. I won't use these for gifts or anything. I'm going to use them for storage. I just like that. The other item we found was just some basic colorful gift basket boxes I guess is what they're called another one I found I'm going to show you this big one this one's kind of cool this one is a snowman and a Santa Claus and it's a box so here's the box but what's in cool is you can either keep it as is or open it up and look inside is the exact same picture so it can be as a frame or a picture frame how cool got two of them. The next gift box, I'm stuck on these boxes, I don't know why, but the next boxes I found were these. Okay, it's a snowman and nutcracker. And the cool thing is, is look, if you can see behind, they actually have a picture of the nutcracker and you can pull this off and use it for something. Or you can keep your box as a storage box. This one has little candy on the side. So, kind of cool if you ask me. And if you're a journal journalist like I am, take this off and use it. It's pretty cool. Moving on, next item I have is called Nature Box. So, now I've only found one bottle at a time, sorry. It's a 8.4 ounce bottle. And I found out this works great for those who work outside or their hands get chapped really bad and bleed and stuff. Really a great, a great soap. It's cold, it's cold press oil is what it is, coconut oil. So pretty cool. It's called Nature Box. Next item I had found was called Pure Silk Conditioner and Shampoo. This is tea tree oil and mint. And they are 14 ounces and these nice little bottles. Now these are going fast at our store. I only seen them once and I only seem to get one set at a time. The other item I found which goes really fast is from Salon Selectives. It's Frizz Control. It's a four ounce bottle and this one is an instant repair four ounce bottle. So another item, great stocking stuffers. Also the Frizz Control works really well. I really enjoy it. And then I got a couple more items. And we picked up for the guys in our family. These are from Power Stick Soothing Balm Aftershave. 
and it is a five ounce and they also have a shave gel five ounce by the same company so pretty cool nice gifts to give the guys the next item is is these really cool emergency flashlights if you press this button down here if this lever comes out and it cranks and I'm trying not to blame you but you turn this on and look at that I'm not going to blind you because it is really blind but nice to have as a stocking stuffer and also stick on your cars in our case could be the house we're always using flashlights and losing batteries how I give up so I also found looks like I found some Lysol durable wipes these are really nice to have there's 20 is there 20 of them no six packs sorry six pack these are nice to have in the kitchen so there's six pack Lysol wipes and then the last looks like I lied I got two more items here next item we have is the Shopkins portfolios they're two pack um, folders so nice little stocking stuffer those are Shopkins I normally buy the two pack I don't buy the one pack it's not worth a dollar but the two pack is I believe and then the last item is one of my favorites this is an hourglass and if you can see it it's dropping sand and it actually works pretty smoothly I'm not had any problems with it but it's a nice little cool stocking stuffer oh yes and the other thing is is watch your Dollar Trees for these they're 3d fabric paint we found these in a dollar store and they're actually fabric paint for 3d so watch your stores for those as well that's it that's all I have for right now and hopefully you have a great evening and we'll talk to you later